Hello everybody. Um, I am just trying to record instead of streaming things today uh, to see if my computer can handle it all better. Uh, at the moment there's no many music playing as far as I'm aware but um, hopefully we can hear me and, and uh, well that's, that's, the, that's the hope. Oh I've got too much stuff on my desk and it's very warm. I've just turned off my fan so that you can hear me but if I slowly melt over the course of the hour that I'm going to play this then, uh, then you know why. We're playing Open Country. Uh, I've not played it before. This is literally the first time I booted it up. It is, um, it's about an open country. And we're about to load it. I hit space to play. So from what I can tell, there's a little bit- Rush Hour, oh, the chaos of big city life. I can't even get a breath of fresh air anymore. Mm. Or some room to move around. Lifeless buildings and skyscrapers everywhere. This is my home for most of the day. My cue. Nothing but cold numbers and paperwork. I feel trapped in a concrete jungle. And it's slowly draining the joy out of my life. <laughs> Alright, Arthur Morgan. I used to be happy and free. Nothing beats the open country. The poetry of the wind crafting a rhyme on every tree and mountain. The applause of the leaves celebrating harmony. I won't find that in here. I'm done with this rat race. <laughs> wasting my best days sitting at a desk under fluorescent lights swapped in paperwork. I don't know what happens tomorrow. But I do know I have my two hands and the open wilderness. I'm home in the open country. Open roads and big blue Ooh. skies. We get, a, we get a, an original song. Crossing over every state line. And some wolves. Friends can always pass the time. Cohabiting with the fuck. Uh, I don't know if. We hope we're gonna Wait, find ourselves. I'm sorry, I've got to turn that off. For the only reason that I don't know if it is going to get me uh, my video delisted or whatever because of audio problems. Because of uh, copyright. Ah, copyright. We have a rabbit and we did have a, a nice fox and little wolf enjoy each other's company. Now, what I was going to say before uh, uh, I was uh, told about the, the strife of living in the city was that um, I think this game, hello Mr. Wolf again is kind of, I'm going to say, a little bit of a mix between like the Hunter, Call of the Wild, uh, kind of just in like setting and stuff, and then um, maybe the forest, a um, little bit of ranch sim or something like that, basically being out and about. The thing I'm looking forward to is the fact that it's co-op, and if I enjoy the game, then uh, I might convince uh, Nanimar to do some multiplayer with me, and it could be a lot of fun. Um, I think... The best thing to do is just start off. Oh, I've got to, I've got to make a character. Righty tighty. Well, I don't know. Is there any way I can? I don't know how there is. Interesting. Well, fair enough. That's our face. Skin tone. Well, I'm as white as can be. Let's, uh, let's, let's leave it at that. I haven't. The, these don't seem to sync up with one another very well. The icon, the icons. We've got a that ponytail. I can't tell. Yeah, he's not actually got a ponytail, and that one's turned into an afro. Well, look. What what does it matter? We're we're out we're out on the open road. We've got <laughs> a redhead is actually just dark hair. That guy's being snuck up on by a by a, an evil Roosevelt elk. And I, I love the idea that <laughs> you're not allowed to have no facial hair. Gosh, that's quite funny. I wonder do all the female characters have to have beards as well. Alright, well I think I've done that. Space to start game. Here we go. We start off in a casino. Now, I've um, the game looks a little bit bare bones from what I've seen so far. And it doesn't say, but I didn't look very hard, that it was um, early access. So I don't know if much more is going to come to it. 
I also need to turn on VSync because I'm getting some screen tearing already. <laughs> and I imagine there's probably lots of music playing right now, but it's all turned off because of the copyright issues. Hello. So what brings you around these some isolated awkward parts? Silences. I've been on the road for a while now. I could use a place to rest before moving on. This is Gary Kent's my name, and fighting oh, wow. to keep this place alive is all my right. game. All right, Gary. It can get a bit wild out there. But everyone's welcome to my crumbling wilderness accommodations. I saw this place by the road and I thought I'd check to see if you have any rooms. Well, as a matter, as a matter of, of fact, fact, my Snow Ridge Lodge takes great pride in being a place of friendly shelter. But alas, as you can see, these are hardly premium conditions. He's got to make well, me fix the place up, now that you mention it, the place could do with a few light touches here and there. No need to sugarcoat it. <coughs> place has seen better days. You know, I think I'm gripped by a spontaneous liking of you. Oh dear. Here's my proposal. No, You look I like someone that can handle the wilds. Okay. I'm not as young as I used to be. Neither am I. And this here establishment is falling apart under my very eyes. I'll let you refuel and stay for free if you help me out with a few outdoor tasks. Right. Sounds like just the sort of thing I've been looking for. I appreciate your willingness to help. In fact, let's throw you straight into earning your stay. Oh, okay. oh you really lost no time putting me to work. <laughs> Here we go. I love the way they've set a game called Open Country, and the very first thing we need to do is do up a bar. Uh, all right, press. It. Was I supposed to do something? Press E to interact with the other characters. I presume. I mean, there's only Gary, so let's talk to Gary. I need to to you Gary. to deliver a package to a friendly neighborhood ranger. His name is Adam Douglas Ainsley. Oh, wow. Full name. Mm, but never call him Douglas. He can't stand then that. Then why did you tell me in the middle name Uh-huh. And where might Ranger Ainsley be at? He's been out and about somewhere between Mellow Meadow and Green Hoof Sanctuary. There's no place And how am I going to find him? Here, take this walkie-talkie. You can use this little gadget to contact him. My advice is to go there and call out to him. He'll <laughs> His advice and is to go to him and there. shout really loud. Okay, I'm on it. All right. Do I get to go outside? I get. Oh, I've got some bandages as well. That's ominous. Am I leaving? Yeah. Oh, wowzers. He said to go to Meadow Hills, right? Travel. A side by side shotgun is more powerful, but lacks uh, enough time to read the menus. There's the loading tips. <laughs> I'll have to create my own music in order to fill these awkward silences. Maybe I'll turn it up a little bit. Ooh, okay. Wow, what was that noise? What is going on? I can hear arrows zipping past my ears already. Alright, so we're outside. Okay. I'm out and about. That's alright. I can deal with that. Press Q to view your current objectives. Reach the camping location. Press and tab to open the map. The camping location is to our east, that's fine. Do I have to drive or can I walk? You need to compass to orient yourself, which is up there. So east is that way. Oh, I sleep in that. Can I drive it? Oh no, that's just a way to get places. Okay, so I can't drive it around, that's all right. That little whooshing noise is a, uh, please stop it. Press shift to sprint. I'm already sprinting. Oh my word. I'm Sonic. Now this is the one thing missing from Hunter Call of the Wild is the ability to move faster than ooh berry bush. The ability to move faster than a meandering river. Mushroom. What's this? Found someone else's spot. Someone's already been here. Then this looks like the place. I should use the walkie-talkie to contact the ranger. How quick was that? I didn't have to go anywhere. Am I really already there? Oh, okay, the place is actually big. I thought, <laughs> ooh, where have I gone? I thought like this in this square was the only <laughs> place we could get to. Oh, but I can zoom out. Uh, oh, okay, we have some actual, it's a good map size, that's all right, I'm not so worried. What does he say? Use the walkie-talkie, I'm opening the toolkit, press that, and scroll to walkie-talkie, and press Hello, that. Hello, Ranger Ainsley, are you there? Oh, okay, I'm not shouting really loud. I've been waiting for you to make contact. Oh. How do you know? Set up a camp in the area. You should find plenty of wood and material. How does Angel know I'm here? I'll call you tomorrow and give you further instructions. Over. 
Am I being drafted into a All right, I guess I'll get on with setting up that camp then. Let's see what's dangerous in here. Loot crate. Oh. Why am I looting crates in an outside simulator? Oh, and the crate's gone. I could use that wood, you know. Improvised tinder. Paper bones using E. Rock, 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 rock pile. Ooh. Feeling dangerous. No, I've probably got too much. Why is there now live bait stored in my backpack? What's in here? Hatchet. Stabby, stabby. Craft tinder, craft a bow drill. They've, they've misspelled supply box. You're not doing yourself any favours. <laughs> Open country. Yeah, this does... I mean, the whole thing does feel a bit cobbled together. I was really coming into this hoping it would be like the next game. That, you know, I'd want to play a, play a lot, but at the moment, not, not convinced. I'm just picking up boxes. Why am I picking up... Is that supply? Yeah, supply is spelt correctly there. What am I supposed to be doing then? Uh, Q to open up craft Tinder. All right, how do I craft? Let's let's. Do I craft at the crafting table? Is that what this is? I'm confused. Oh, I'm looking at the supply box. That's why. I've been picking up items. How do I craft with them? Uh, C, M, no. Bushcraft. Oh, okay. It doesn't tell me how to get. Uh, well, maybe I missed it. Okay, so it was. They said something about a bow drill. What do I need? A branch and a log and a hatchet. Okay. Well, let's do what they do on Minecraft. Hit a tree. Oh, no. No, guess not. Oh, wow, there's, there's only one running speed. There's, literally about to leave this game already. How do I pick stuff up? What is that? What was that? Something in a very big burrow. What is going on? Leaves. I don't want to pick up leaves. I want to see what monster is hiding in this burrow. Don't try and convince me that's a rabbit's burrow. I want to cut down some trees. What about you? Log. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I can pick up an entire log, but I can't cut a tree down. Okay, then. So I got a log. Are there more logs in that water cap? A log and a... What was it? A, a log and a branch. Okay, it's all down here by the river. I'll pick up a few. Oh, and there were some leaves that it needed from me. So press tab and navigate to bushcraft to craft tinder. Thank you. Did I do it? I guess I did. Where is it? Okay. What's my next task? Build a camp next to the room cabin and start a campfire. Okay. Another great hot. I, honestly, I challenge anybody to go for a walk in any part of the countryside and not get incredibly suspicious of a human-sized hole in the ground. I am near a ruined cabin. You are not wrong. Okay, so what was it? I want to craft a... Uh, what button was I supposed to get to? Was it this one? Camp. I need a branch and a log. Again, right. Does everything require a branch and a log? Just answer this to me now. Oh, and now, am I walking really slowly? What? Have, have I picked up too much and I've not realised? What? Oh, it says I need eight branches and three logs. Why am I going so slowly now? Is there a weight limit? There is, and I'm 
0.79 over the weight limit. So I shouldn't have been picking up all those rocks you were telling me to pick up, you numbskull. How do I drop you? Right. Well, look, I made a can. At least the game has that, I suppose. Can I knock it over? Nope. Alright. be nice if there was some kind of a a weight limit thing on the screen, seeing as it looks like you can run out of space quite quickly. Oh, and now I'm going too slowly again. Oh, and now I'm stuck. Marvellous. And the turn speed, I'm going to have to turn up the sensitivity on this camera. Okay, teething issues. Teething issues, that's all. How about we give the player tooltips to pick up every rock they can see and then immediately get them to run out of inventory space. Shall I just build one here? Is it gonna like penalize me if it's not right next to the cabin? Oh, it says you are now near the ruined cabin. Maybe I'll do it here then. Uh, okay, what button was it? Tab, camp. Ooh, okay, all right. So we have Build it there. Ignite the campfire using the bow drill. All right, all right. Bow drill ignition. Start fire. Oh, nice and easy. What's my cook some mushrooms? Do I have mushrooms? I don't have any mushrooms or a branch. All right, I have to find yet more branches. Still in your backpack. How do I find mushrooms? Is there like a, a view button? Something where I can see see what might be, be nearby? No? Hmm. I did see some mushrooms over it. What was that? Was that another rock? It was. What are you? Mush mushrooms! Do I, have, do I want to pick up more? I don't know. I can hear a very upset sounding duck. What is that? Is that a duck? Yeah, maybe. Oh, it's over here, wasn't it? Prepare. Prepare for what? Mushrooms. Rest till morning. Okay. I've got to press escape about seven dozen times. Interact, rest. Do I save how long until? Do I, can, can I change how long? Oh. Okay, well it's nowhere near night time, so I'm not going to sleep for 12 hours to end up in the middle of the night, so I guess I'll just wander around, right? You might now be able to hear my computer overheating. It's currently about 30 or 35 degrees in my bedroom right now. Um, and so my computer's overheating and has turned on its internal fan, which it usually turns on if there's some kind of a fire in the computer. So, you know, hopefully, what was that noise? Hopefully all is well in there. Return to the lake area, so we can't. I've done that. What do you mean the lake area? The lake area appears to be down there. Gosh, this sensitivity is is uh, is tricky. How do I turn that up? Camera sensitivity, like there, or maybe it's aim sensitivity. I can't tell. And shall I turn up the audio just a little bit? Okay, well, there's no music playing in the main game anyway. So what I'm going to do is wait until evening time and then I'll go back to the camp and go a bit. That sounds sensible, I think. Is there anything else interesting I can craft? I want to craft a bow. I need just one branch, let's do it. Are you a branch? No, these branches apparently are insufficient to have the status of being a good branch. I've just seen that all my levels are going down. It hasn't yet taught me. It's taught me how to 
build a shelter but not told me how to drink water. Can I just walk up? I don't know if I should walk up, walk up to the river. Not the... yeah. Well, we'll see. I have a bow. And I, oh, that's why I needed the rocks. Don't tell me you need like one rock per arrow. One game that did crafting really well, uh, but I think perhaps handled its updates a little bit poorly, was um, Journey of Life. You could craft stuff that was like, a ra it didn't need to be in the inventory, it just needed to be somewhere nearby. And that makes a lot of sense, because when, when you want to put something together, it's not always all in your pockets in one go. It's like on the table in front of you, and you'll have something on the shelves and things like that. So, um, oh, floating rocks, eh? I'm a Jedi. Right, let's craft some arrows, Mr. Jedi. Oh my gosh. What? Oh, I'm out, I'm out of branches. I thought I was... <laughs> okay, okay, where am I crouching? Stop, calm down. No, don't want a log. Don't want another log. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, hello music. That I've got to talk over. Um, please tell me I can. Don't know. Give me. It's not controls. I don't have a V-Sync option, and so I'm getting screen tearing and stuff like that. Hopefully, you can't see it too much in the video. Wow. The duck sound that they've got sounds like somebody stepping on a balloon full of like custard. Yeah. Just like that. Don't want any more mushrooms. I want branches for all my arrows. Mm -hmm. Can I drink from here? Nope, I can pick up rocks. Branch? No? This is um, a living nightmare. And I've just, the time hasn't changed since I've been standing here, which is slightly frustrating. Because I was wa wasting time. I mean, the, the sun's still up there, but up in the top right, that little ticker hasn't really moved. And it's asked me to sleep until morning. Let's just do it. Does it say sleep until morning? Have I missed something obvious? Yeah, it says sleep until morning. Well, I'll sleep until whatever time that is. How do I start? It says, okay, so I can only start when it's white, which will allow me to sleep until night time, because otherwise my needs will run out while I'm asleep. What on Hello. earth? Are you there? Hello. Sorry for the abrupt awakening. What do you mean, are you there? I'm right here. That's all right. Here's the package. Thanks for taking the time to bring it over. So, you're the ranger around these parts. What is he doing? Yeah, that's me, Ranger Ainsley. You know, these parts are beautiful and may seem quiet, but it can sure be busy work. Needlessly. It sure is. What brings you around these wilds? I just needed to get away for a while. Get away from the daily routine. I feel like I haven't had a rest as good as last night in years. What do you mean last night? I understand. You know, seeing as you're set it's for a change of pace, evening. I could use a capable hand to help around. I'll reward your help, of course. Mm -hmm. You're looking for a partner? Yeah, you could say that. Oh, well, how no. could I refuse? I'm not gonna marry you either. All right then. Glad to hear. I'll be around the Snow Ridge Lodge later. Check with me, and I'm bound to find some work for you. In that case, I'll see you around. Excellent. Well, I got to head off. Duty calls. Take care, partner. <laughs> Duty. I think they have the exact same ATV sound as Hunter Call of the Wild, you know? Okay, so I've got to return and talk to Gary. He literally just drove away. I'm not gonna lie. I hate this game. I've just realised that it's now telling me it's morning even though it only let me sleep for like three hours in the middle of the afternoon. <sighs> Do you know what? 
They haven't even given me water to how to drink water. Ah, I've been recording for 25 minutes. That's a decent YouTube video, isn't it? Well, I'm going to go and have an ice lolly and uh, turn my fan back on. <laughs> so, <laughs> thank you to all of you for watching. I cannot yet recommend this game because I've played it for less than half an hour and uh, I am bored mindless. I'm going to go and play some Red Dead Online. All the best.